Hey guys, it's Denise from On Demand Resource, and I just wanted to come talk to you about a few things. The first thing being job fairs. At job fairs, make sure you get there on time, early, at least 30 minutes early to see what the crowd is going to be like. You don't want to wait to the last minute for the room fills up and it'll be hard to navigate. Make sure you take plenty of resumes with you so that you can leave them with the employers there. Number three, make sure that you do your research and see who's going to be there. So you make sure that you're not wasting your time with companies that you don't plan on or working for. Number two, resumes. Resumes are changing rapidly. There's always something being added or taken away. The first thing that I've noticed has been taken away is addresses. They no longer want you to put your address on the resume. If you have a LinkedIn profile, put that, your business email and your telephone number along with your name number two they no longer want objectives don't be the one that puts the cliche objective on there i want to work for a company that has room for advancement they know why you're looking because that's why you're applying number three you don't no longer have to put references upon request they know that you have references because you work places that's how you were able to build a resume and lastly, on the resume, you no longer want paragraph form. You want to put bullet points. You need about three to four bullet points. With that said, you want to make sure that you are telling them what you can do for their company. What have you done for the other company? If you had hit some big milestones with the previous company or your current company, let them know that. Give them a few statistics, some numbers. That will make them know that they're getting a good candidate. And... Thank you for your time.